This is Johan Gamble, and we're back playing Wonderful 101. Last time we were going through uh, Operation 001 Part A. Uh, we're still in that operation, but I wanted to go ahead and show you the menu real quick. So this is where you can use items um, like these things, um, stakes and stuff like that. Um, and here are the custom blocks. As you can see, we only have one hole for a block, but um, that little bar down there, the more we fight, we'll be able to um, bring in more custom blocks. Here we have the, this can show you all the Unite Morphs if you've forgotten, um, any skills you might have bought, such as the wonderful, I mean you might have gotten like the wonderful Stinger, um, things like that. You can also de-equip them too if you don't want them for whatever reason. Um, items, descriptions, uh, here's the bottle cap collection, we only have 5 out of 100. There's actually 101 bottle caps, but the last one is just got them when you've gotten all the others. Um, here are the Geth Jerk files, we'll be reading those on the bonuses. Um, wonderful files, bonuses, and then the wonder figure, wonder, wonderful figures, if you, uh, this is what's on the gamepad. Uh, we'll go ahead and look at those, um, later too. Um, here we have the mixer, which will allow us to make all these items you can see on the right, but what we want to do is make the item on the very bottom right corner, which is the credit card, which will allow us to buy anything in the store for free. So we're going to go ahead and hold off till then. Um, last time we uh, beat, uh, died Go- I always forget their names. We beat a really big Dogu, and we unlocked uh, a Kakuriga. So we're going to go ahead and go in there. Alright, so inside is secret mission number 11, the Kagoriga. Um, some missions have these, some uh, some don't. Um, depending on what they are, they can be very hard. Um, and also, depending on the difficulty of the level you're playing, it differs. So right now, the only level we can play on is normal. Um, but on hard mode, they're way harder. Trust me, these things get crazy on the harder levels. Jeez, doing 100% in this game was not easy. But it was worth it, man. It was fun. Alright, he's charging at me. Boom. Let's just keep going ahead using our big Unite Sword. I think this guy's running at me. Nope. There you are. I knew. Oh, and you can also pick up some enemy weapons. Um, actually, when an enemy is summoned, they will actually make a, um... And you can also recruit enemies by wonderlining around them when they're about to die. Sir, only these guys, though. You can't do it with any other enemies. Um, <laughs> the masks on their face. Uh, oh yeah, see I did horrible at combo there. Um, but one of the things I wanted to mention, um, uh, is, um, when you, um, oh crap, what was I gonna say? I forgot. It was important too. Okay, whatever, I'll probably remember later. It was something important, but whatever. Alright, so we're back. Yeah, I cannot remember what I was gonna say, but, I don't know, hopefully I remember. And was if we head up here, we can find some more batteries, but there's also a character we can find. Let's go ahead and head up this way. There's another wonderful 101 we can grab. I think she's a fist user. The Fury of 200 Fists. So now we have 100 sit Now we have 100 members. Uh, most of them are temporary, but we do have 100. Sweet Knuckles. Nice. So let's go ahead and make a big old fist. No, it's not like fun. Make a big old fist. There we go. Boom! 100 size fist, baby. Yeah, it's really slow, but crazy powerful. Alright, break some stuff. Let's go ahead and turn this. Oh, look at that. People are burning over there. Oh, hopefully we can help them. Anyways, just use... The Wonderliner can also collect items. I don't know if I mentioned that. It can. It can collect some items off in the distance, which is pretty helpful. Alright, come on. Let's fight. Come on, charge at me. There you go. I know you wanted to. Boom, baby. Wonder Guts, your booty. I love Wonder Guts, though. It's so good. Right. I need to use my fists a little more. I need to level it up. It's just, like I said, it's so good for... Oh, I couldn't collect it because I already had 100 people. Alright, that should be it. Oh, hold on. Oh, we got a big guy whose name escapes me. I'm gonna use my fist on him, I think. Ooh, yeah. Boom! We should have plenty of points for a good rank. And I'll throw in a couple of swords. There. And we get more points for attacking him when he's dizzy, too, which is good. Let's get rid of these little guys right here. They're annoying. See, so yeah, if you know what you're doing, you can straight up destroy him. Oh, now I remember what I was gonna say. Okay, when an enemy is summoned that can actually drop a, a weapon, they actually will, um... 
they'll uh they'll they're, there's a certain color around them that appears. So if an enemy is teleported in and it's blue, if you use the sword to finish it off, it will pro it it will I think I'm not sure if it guarantees it will drop the item, but it does seem to actually make it a lot more likely. So you're gonna want to do that. There's some people up there. I'm gonna have to get them in a minute. Now there is a porthole over here we can get. Oops. And that has another wonderful figure. I think there's some other fish down here we will also grab. We need the money. Give me that money! I want that money! There you go. It looks like a big old hook too that I'm drawing. Alright. Oh, get in there. Why aren't you in there? Oh, there we go. Get in the Mario pipe. There we go. Alright, let's keep running. Oh, and really quick before you run off, there is another wonderful 101 right over here. You're gonna wanna get him. Oh, um, and we have a justice missile. What happens is when you get a certain number of citizens, they will actually become a weapon for you that you can use in battle. I've actually never used it though, to be honest. Um, so I'll probably have to try that sometime on my own. And here we have Wonder Guitar! Nice. I think. Okay, whatever, there's just more dogus. Oh, damn it! Hold hold downs too. I hate these things. I hate when the dogus get in the way of the blast that's supposed to hurt them and not the not you know what I mean. There you go, that's what I like when they get hit by their own uh oh. Here they come! Oh jeez! Oh! Both of them tried to rear end me! Don't you be doing that! I don't appreciate that! Um, if you actually get their sh um, their shield cracked enough and you hit them with a huge Unite Morph, it will break. So that's nice. Okay, he's ramming us. Ooh, be careful. The nice thing is, though, they do make a huge sound before they're about to hit you with their, um, with their, uh, their blast attack. So if you just pay attention... The only thing is though, I hear everything a couple seconds later, so that's not useful at all for me. So I have to be actively paying attention or I will get my ass blasted. Alright. These guys are still over there. Come on. Yeah, I'm probably not going to do well in time. It's taking way too long to kill these guys. Uh oh, but you lost. You sh oh! Oh, you're dead now. Okay. Oh, this blasting. Oh no, the helmet! There's some batteries up there we can grab if you need them. I don't, though. Uh, so you're gonna want to wonder line around this. Go ahead and move. Come on! It will act as a protection barrier for you. I don't know if you can actually. I mean, later on when you get a certain wonderful 101, you can actually run through those pretty easily without this helmet. But I don't know if you can run without the helmet or the wonderful one that helps you. Alright, guys, put the helmet down. Throw it away. Okay, they're not going to throw it. Fine. Just follow me then. We're going to want to go over here because, if you remember, we saw a building that was on fire. And there's some people trapped up there. So what you're going to want to do is, you, you can do, you're not, I don't think you're supposed to come over here this early. But as you can see, the fist allows us to jump in the fire without getting hurt. But it's a little tricky. You kind of... You gotta kind of finagle it. Just get up there. Ugh. You gotta just kind of jump. Okay. Ah, my goodness. Oh my gosh, I can make it. I can do this. All right. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep doing this because it might take a minute. Sometimes it takes a while. Sometimes I get it instantly. So I'll see you in just a minute while I try and finagle this. Uh, I'll see you in a second. There we go. Okay. I had to use the car to help me. Um. I did get hurt though a little bit. So here we have another wonderful 101. It is another fist user. We have Wonder Judo, a martial artist. All right, and if you notice, you probably see something a little thing in the air. These are our hero heart fragments. By collecting four of them, we increase our life. Um, there's actually two ways to increase your life in this game though. You probably, I probably did it before, but I didn't mention it. And when you get a certain number of heroes, and when you get certain of them leveled up. Um, they will go ahead and make your, uh, they will, uh, upgrade your HP. And then by collecting four hero hearts also, too. 
can I? I can't tell. Can I? Uh, is there? I don't. Oh, there we go. Just trace that seven, and you get. Oh, platinum coin that I don't care. About. Oh, oh, jeez. I forgot those running too fast. And then the helmet becomes useless. There we go. That window gives you a platinum. That window gives you a gesture. Another window that gives you anything? Is that middle window did anything? Nope. Okay. Oh, look at this couple making out during an invasion. Whoa! <laughs> He's like, I am out of here, baby. Can't really blame him though. A huge meteorite. I don't think it was nice to push his girlfriend, but uh, yeah. All right, here we have a new enemy. These things aren't too bad. They can be a little tricky though because they can pierce your uh, guts with a couple of their moves. But if you just pay attention, um, you should be fine. You can you can guts a lot of their moves, though. So when they're jumping in the air like that, you cannot guts them, because his stinger will come down and hit you. But if he's just, like, raising one of his claws, you can. Let's see. Come on. Raise your claw, baby. Do something. Okay. Oh, all right. He was about to attack me, but... Okay, you want to avoid that, because he'll start swinging... Yeah, see, that's not good. Okay, you want to avoid that, because he'll swing... So tail around, and that can do some serious damage. He's also pretty easy to do team attacks on. But I want to show you gutsing. Oh, move. Thankfully, it's okay if your members get hurt. If the main person gets hurt, then you lose life. Okay, we're going to start using our first. There we go. Oh, ooh. I can't- I never remember if you can actually guts that move. I always just afraid to. Come on! Do your attacks with- oh! Bail! He's not doing an attack where I can guts. Or he might have been, I was just too afraid. Some of his attacks- oh, see? There we go, we got a high enough combo multiplayer that our server can electrify. Yeah, see, we didn't do too well. If I gutsed one of his moves, it would have been better, but... A lot of his moves look really similar, so I kind of- Like, some of his, you know... Stinger attacks look very similar to ones that won't work. Anyways, if you actually come over here, though, it's kind of a little Easter egg. He's like, I'm so sorry, I didn't mean to abandon you! And you can recruit them. He's like, ah. And that's actually a, uh, 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 bottle cap. Pretty sure there's nothing here. Thank you. Oh, and there we go, that's the end of the mission. We did it! So yeah, I still got platinum because I got a couple of golds, so overall not bad at all. Not too bad for just one single run. Uh, so there we go, and as you can see, you can see your total damage. I took 250, uh, how many enemies you recruited. You pretty much always get a mystery bonus gift. I don't think there's ever been a time when you don't get one. I can't. Alright, so let's go ahead and just go to the wonderful mart. Let's see what we can buy. I wanna, I don't have a, do I have a, actually... I have enough to, uh... Actually, one thing we're going to check real quick and see is if uh, how many vegetables I have. Because if I can make a credit card, we're doing that. Mm, not quite. Damn. Because if uh, if we if I had a credit card, I would make the uh, Ukemi. Because Ukemi is crazy good. So let's just go ahead. Uh, we can buy Unite Ball. Let's see. Speed Chart. No, I don't know. I want to buy Dodge Mine. Dodge Mine. I don't have enough. Uh... I could buy Unite Ball, Unite which is actually Ball. pretty useful for in, um, evading some stuff, so we'll just buy that. Oh, and if- oh, damn, I wanted to show you-, you it shows you, like, a little receipt when you buy something. Alright, I'll have to show you that next time. Uh, yeah, I don't have anything else I can buy. Yeah, that's about it. Uh, okay, I guess we'll just- actually, you know, I'm gonna- uh, let's- let's see what's on the next operation. Alright, so here we are again. Let's go ahead and just start collecting stuff. There is a thing you can collect up there. Go ahead, circle around these guys. Get the police. We're going to come up against some enemies immediately. Oops. That's not I wanted. I wanted the sword. There we go. Oop! Don't think so, punk. I'm not being hit by you. And these guys' dodges are kind of annoying. They just dodge right out of your attack. Oh, 
Alright. Some more. Let's go ahead. Nice. Likeable hero. Oh, you can guts this. Which you want to, actually. Nice! And now, blue is all the way leveled up, so we can actually change him to a different sword user. Which we will do that, because that way, we can hopefully get one, a uh, wonderful uprising. So there we go. Just keep doing that. Just keep... Oop! We're gonna wanna bail! Okay. Hit him. There we go. Oh, he's gonna kick. Yeah, this guy has a lot of moves that can be guts. There's still a couple of dogies left. They have like tiny little propellers on their head. Alright. Let's grab these citizens. We should be running across a new enemy. Very soon. Alright. Grab an enemy. Wish I could get a little wonder mask. Alright, here we come to a new enemy. There are uh, variations on the hoe downs, they're the ray downs, except they don't shoot, I mean they can shoot uh, uh, bombs at you, but what you want to do is summon your sword, and you, oh, okay, well I guess he just wants to ram us. Normally you want to summon your sword, and he'll shoot a laser at you, and you can just reflect. And that's about it. And it will damage your shield. You gonna do it big boy, or, there we go. So yeah, it base it gives you the exact same points as if you were doing unite uh, guts on. Him. And then with that, he's defenseless. Be careful, because he could suddenly just start drive. Yep, he can just suddenly drive at you. Okay, we gotta change Wonder Blue so we can let someone else get some experience. And I gotta scratch my ear. But we're still on mission though, so we gotta keep running. Oh gosh! Ah! Uh, never mind. Let's go back this way, guys. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh! The floor is breaking beneath my feet. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. It's a big hand. Hey, walk for the... Hey, I wasn't done reading that. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, the more uh, one, uh, the more people you put into your Unite Morphs during the cutscene, do you actually get additional money. Woo! Nice. Nice one. And there we go. Now I'm going to go ahead and change... Uh, scratch my ear again. I'm going to change my ear, actually. I can do that. I'm going to go ahead and change my wonderful one. My sword user. And we're going to use... Uh, let me see. We don't really have a ton of... Oh, no, we have... We're going to use Wonder Guitar, because Wonder Guitar is cool. All right. Let's go ahead. Now, there's three citizens we can get here. Our first one is actually right here. <laughs> it looks... I don't know why, but it looked like Napoleon for a second just kind of like... Whatever, dude. And we have another one. Wonderful Socho. The convenience store clerk. Man, he looks really mad. Sass Knuckles. Okay, some citizens. Go ahead and climb up here. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned this, but um, all the wonderful ones, they're all the same amount of strength. I know they show different stats on like, their thing, but they're all the exact same. None of them is stronger than another. There are certain the special wonderful ones that the special wonderful wonder ones that we get uh, as bonuses that you have to really work for. They have special abilities that I think do make them stronger than normal ones, but that's a little different. Then let's just get an elevator. It's really nice in this elevator. And oh my gosh! Ah, well, thank goodness we can build a new one. Haha! <laughs> Seriously, the Wonderliner is amazing. I can see Wonder Guitar's hair poking out. And here is another sword user. Wonder Magician! Mm. I like the little bird coming out of his head. Alright, let's get going. Now, we're going to go ahead. If you make a triangle, you can make the Wonder Glider. By pressing B, the jump button, you can go up. And you just kind of have to do this. It's pretty easy. You can actually use the Wonder Glider for combat if you're really good. Because it does get an upgrade that allows it to do damage. But I never use it, because it's not... I'm sure you could really do some crazy stuff with it, but I've never been good enough with it. The guy Gujin! I like that it shows his footprint. What's his wisdom? Oh, we didn't see how smart he was. It's a big dude. Initiating attack. Initiating attack. Women's Earthling Annihilation. Hey, I don't appreciate that, dude. 
Oh gosh, that is a. Oh. Jerk matter. We're gonna it's gonna call people that from now on. Team, unite up. Um, if you're wondering how I'm able to see through the mess, if you just hold the R2 button, you can do that. So what we gotta do now is just destroy these things. Um, using multiple morphs is... Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to use them in the air. Using multi-morph is pretty useful here. Um, the sword's good because it can hit many of them at once, but it is weaker, uh, so you could use this, uh, this. But the time, the time limit's pretty lenient. So just unite spring over that. Alright, just go ahead and just make a big-ass sword. Oh, good. Wonder Tennis leveled up. And we got life up. Let's go ahead and use our fists for a minute. They do it, it does good damage. It just breaks it a little faster. But you kind of have to focus on one. All right, and I think did we get them all? All right. Now that we got them all, we have to go ahead and make a uh, wonderliner all the way over here. And go ahead and just start doing the same thing to these. It's going to use some unite more uh, multi morphs to go ahead. The they do it does drain a bit of battery though, so be careful. Because I could have, I could have got myself into a sticky situation there, because I did run out, I did get a little low on battery. It's everything you use pretty much uses battery, except for just bringing out your very small base ten unite morph. That doesn't use battery, but pretty much everything else does. Wonder post. Oh damn! I fudge. I thought I could. I thought I was far enough. Damn it! I forgot I don't have Ukeme. <laughs> oh well. My rank will just not be that amazing, that's all. Thank you, got Wonderful Rising, which is super good. I can juggle. Oh, and now we can, uh, we have room for another custom slot. This is good, but I haven't even used one yet. Okay, so he's gonna try and pound right here. Let's go ahead. Unite Guts! See, so yeah, I can't believe I got hit there. But that's okay. My rank should still be pretty good. But we're not done quite yet, though. His arm's malfunctioning. We gotta go ahead and twist that baby! And you wanna twist it fast because an enemy's gonna come out of his mouth. If you do it fast enough, you can do it before the enemy attacks you, but I usually tend to stop just for a second so I can make sure that I don't get hit. Oh, I did it way too early. But if you're really good, though, you can just get it done really quick. But I, I just tend to be a little more careful. Because I don't have Ukeme, which means I can't save myself from any damage. Alright, just spin, come on. Turning. I want to see your hands bleed red! There you go. We're out of here. Well, not quite. Your arm's out of here, though. Make a tiny little hand. There we go. Damage level 30%. Raising from engagement zone. Yeah, you better fly. The weapon has retreated from your location. What rock was that thing hiding under? There's more where that came from. Team, let's move. Roger. There we go. And how bad did I do? Okay, so yeah, if I didn't get damaged, we'd have your black. Now, I believe the six, if we circle around it... There we go. Okay, but you know what, though? I think this is a good place to end the video here. So this has been Johan Gamble. Thanks for watching. See you next time as we continue to play more Wonderful 101. Okay, bye then.